Hey there, we're going to take a look at three more packs of Naruto Approaching Wind cards. I have three more packs after this, and that will do it for the Naruto cards for the time being. If I find any at a particularly cheap price, I'm sure I'll pick them up, but otherwise I think this might be it for Naruto cards, just because... The numbering's really frustrating, the packaging is quite unpleasant, and I'm just not in love with the cards as much as I am with some of the other stuff I've been opening. So we're going to start here with Kunihisa, Earth-style Headhunter Jutsu, Petrifying Attack, oh I forgot to, there's the whole four card thing, uh, Naruto Uzumaki and Rock Lee, Unusual Strength, Ten Ten, Overflowing Red Chakra, Currency Jutsu, Karasuki, and the rare is the symbol, the Proud Clan. I just finished the uh, the first story arc of the manga um, <clears throat> a couple nights ago. So that puts me on volume 28, first part of what would be Shippuden or whatever, after the two and a half year time skip. So this card right here should be the hollow, so we'll put that to the back. Another Kanahisa. Abandonment. Agari Kaizen. Crystal Ice Mirror. Might Guy. Binding Destiny. Ninja Art. Kajaku Wing. Rashness. Rare here is Kimimaro. And the hollow is the Shadow Possession. Shadow Possession Jutsu. Should be the hollow. Alright, we got Kiki. Last Ditch Attack. Naruto Uzumaki. Power of the Byakugan. Rock Lee. The ones moving in the dark. Pakun. Affected Body. Rare is Ishidate. And the hollow is Konohamaru. And that's gonna do it for today's video. Just gonna clean up my my mess there, make a different mess to the side of the desk, and we're good to go. Thanks for watching.